Hello everyone, this is Amanda from Creative Pouring. Um, guess what I got through the post? Hurrah! Yes, I got some Extreme Sheen 24 karat gold. I just happened to buy five. I don't think these are going to last very long, but never mind. Um, looking forward to using this. This is the first time. This is a little test canvas. It's a reused one um, that I scraped. And it must have had silicon in but I don't know if you can see that there's a little bit of um I don't know if you can see there's a little bit of not pitting all the way through to the canvas but there's a few little craters but I'm gonna go with it anyway. Um I've decided again from um inspiration from Sarah Mack who does some wonderful videos at the moment um utilising a ninja swipe and all the deco art extreme sheen. So what I've got is, I'm just going to use these colours, and I've got a little extra blue there. So I've got the um, Extreme Sheen Gold uh, by Deco Art, and I've done this one-to-one um, -one with Floetrol. Now my flow troll in the UK is very thick, so I've um, I've had to. It's not liquid S, it's flow troll water. I've had to um, water this down quite significantly. Bear with me one moment. I'm just going to do these blinds because otherwise that's better. Okay. Otherwise you get light on the canvas and you can't see. Is that better? It looks better. Maybe not with that on. Hang on. One moment. So it's gone dark all of a sudden outside. It's just had a bit of a thunderstorm. Right, okay, I'm back. Okay, so extreme sheen gold. Then this is my Amsterdam Payne's Grey, which I have covered the canvas with. Um, it's still fairly a, a good consistency, not too thick. Now, I've mixed two whites. I don't know if you can see in there. One is really frothy, and that is my Jackson Art White. And this is a Pebio White. So um, I think if I ever do anything with this, it's I, I just can't use it now. I'll have to wait till that, all that froth goes. But this is much better. Um, this is Pepio Studio Acrylics High Viscosity. What's that one? I know I'm going to dangle my sleeve in this painting in a minute. Never mind. Then I had, um, I wanted to put a bit of flash of pink in. I don't have the Blick Acrylic like Sarah does, but... This is uh, a little mix of uh, my Amsterdam and a little bit of Pebio um, Violet Blue Iridescence. So I've just mixed a little bit of those together. And then this was like a little bit of Prussian Blue I'd left over from another pour. And uh, just want to put a flash of blue in there. And then I added a baby bit of the metallic um, sapphire. From deco art. So I'm going to do a little um, puddle here and then build on that and see where we get to. I'm just going to literally pour this. There's no float, uh, there's no um, silicon in this, so it's just flow trial water. a bit of this in there. I don't know if this paint's too thick but we'll soon find out. It looks a bit thick to me. Okay well we're going to go with it. I'm just going to put a little bit of paint grey on that. And then I'm going to put a bit of the pink against the paint's grey. Blue on there, just a drop, because I'm not going to need a lot 
of paint on this canvas. It's only a, uh, I'll measure it in a minute. Um, yeah, it's not that big a canvas. A bit of white in the middle of there. Um, and then I'm going to do this, this blue to get maybe a little bit of. I've just done that, Dopey. What am I doing? Don't want grey. So I'm going to do that. Oh, yeah, I think this is way too thick. But anyway, I'm going with the flow. I'm going with the flow now. It's too late, I think. Right, I think that may be enough. I'm just going to drizzle a little bit of this. Over the top. the gold in the middle. I'm going to go with that. Bring a bit more of this around the edge. Just let that pinch in a little bit. And then we're going to give it a Swiperoonie. So this is the problem now because you then you don't have anything here. Okay. So what I'm gonna do is just Yeah, it's far too thick, look. Remedy, a bit of fortune there. A bit of water in there. Need to get it to pour a little bit more, don't I? And a bit more water in the white. Let's see if I can stretch this out a little bit and then I will have my torch. Torch. Oh, here we go. Alright. <sighs> Let's just see if I can do anything with this. The colours are lovely, but it's definitely on the thicker side. Of it. So I'm just going to do oops. another little puddle here.
blob. I don't think this is too thick. We only had a baby bit of that anyway. I'm going to stretch that out first. Let's see if we can get that covering that canvas again. Just do a quick shimmer. Okay, this has got to go down there. I think I've just got to sit and stretch it out. Yeah, far too thick. I don't know what's going on with that. It's really pretty though. Now, what should I do? Now, am I going to risk trying to fix this or am I going to... Scrape it. Don't want to waste any paint. Let's just swipe it. Oh, he thinks it's a scrape. Scrape of a scrape. This is going to be hard to redeem. Okay, right, if in doubt, you know what you do, you do a swipe. So I'm going to leave that there. I've got some very runny um, white somewhere. Emergency white. Okay, I'm going to leave that there. And then I'm going to put a bit of this in here. Right, I've got these weird and wonderful colours here, and this is what I'm going to do. These have got no flow troll in them, so I'm just going to do a bit more pink. Less. And then lilac. Oh, no, I don't want lilac. No, I don't. I want. Then I've got a lot of a bit of purple. Never have too much purple. This has got no silicon in it. Just because it's here, and I've only got a baby bit. Right. Okay. Let's 
see if we can save something out of this. And if not, it will be a straight. Right, I'm going to put this in here and put a couple of drops of silicon in it, and then Baby tad of water, where's the water? Right, let's just give this a quick Oh Yeah. You got that purple's gonna take over now, don't you? See what happens. Down there a bit. Okay, right. Let's pour this in the end here. Do this way. Okay. That's how we're going to be absolutely some dubby dozy, as they say, or an absolute disaster. Right, let that drop on there and then slowly but surely. Oh, this might need a double swipe. Swipe. Pick a bit more of that white up. Okay. And let's see what to that. Okay, 
I'm not bold, it's not very shaky. And it's just too thick, this paint. Alright, you know what comes next, don't you? Yes! Blue balls! You know when you're determined <laughs> not to lose a canvas because that's pretty damn boring. Right, here we go, blue mod because there's some very nice paint under there. That's the thing. That's why I think you want to give it a go. Right, there we go. Nice to help make that there a little bit. Fingers. Let's do the ones up here. Beautiful. Right there. Still not very pretty, is it? All right, have we saved it? What do we reckon? Pretty little cells they are, actually. I just didn't like the white top. I don't want to tip it off now, I've done it. There we go. Just have to leave it to level out, which is quite cute though. I like the colours. At least it's a save from what it was. Maybe some more of this gold's going to come up. Alright, and then I'm going to thin this down, this paint, and when I do it again, I will not be beaten. Alright, there you go. Now you see, not necessarily my cup of tea, but I know other people will like it. Get some room. Well, there's lots to look at, and I think that's important. I quite like that. In the end, something different anyway. Okay, um, I'm just going to touch up the sides, my shape, sure that they look. Um, acceptable. I'll just put Payne's grey down the edges there and there and there and just check that there's white on the edge there. But meh. it's quite cute really for a save. I love the colours. I love those colours anyway. Okie dokie. Well that's that one. Um, I'm going to touch up the edges and then I'm going to go again. Okay. This is Amanda, over and out. Bye-bye.